A remembrance ceremony was held tonight for a Cal Poly student who died Monday after he was hit by a truck last week. Let's get you up to speed. Sean Hillman was riding his bike when he was struck by a pickup truck last Friday at the intersection of Grand Avenue and Frederick Street. The 20 year old was pronounced dead on Monday. Sean was a first year student from Seattle who was studying architectural engineering. Cal Poly is offering emotional support for people who knew Sean or witnessed the collision. And KSBY News reporter Austin Herbaugh joins us live from Cal Poly with how the community is paying tribute. Austin. Sean Hillman was just 20 years old, but he left a lasting impression at Cal Poly as a first year student who had already found his calling. A young life tragically cut short. Fellow Cal Poly students say that Sean Hillman was full of potential. He was brilliant and so smart, and he seriously was going to change the world one day. He was always going to greet you with a positive attitude and a smile and a high five. Sean's family traveled from Seattle all the way to San Luis Obispo to be greeted with support from the Cal Poly community. There's no other word to describe him except incredible. I have had so many instances this week where I got to get to know his family a little better and all the experiences and personality that I shared with him came right back through his family and just saying that we agree he's exactly like that. As a freshman, Sean was already well known at the College of Architecture and Environmental Design. I got to know Sean pretty well. He was always at the events and you notice when a first year is very involved and you could see on his face he was always very passionate, eager to learn, grateful to be here and this was definitely a place that he belonged. And Sean was also looking forward to the Startup Design Village, an event where students build a structure at the architecture graveyard and sleep in it overnight. I just remember kind of being like, oh, this is a design. I, th I think it's all right. And Sean's like, okay, give me two days. I'm going to make that. I'm going to make that into real life. I'm going to make it so the structure holds. And this is the finished product, which was completed and set up by Sean's team members on Friday. We came up with the idea for the roof to hold all the pedals together. We couldn't have done it without him. It, he contributed immensely. And this is Sean's hammock, which was turned into a memorial for the 20 year old. We thought about him going up here. We thought about him this morning. Those who knew Sean say that now is the time to show support to the family as the long healing process process begins. Design Village, this event specifically, he was very involved, always in the shop, uh, working on his project with his group. But we're here to honor him and celebrate what an amazing person he was and is. So we're really happy to gather together and come together in green today. Now Design Village continues tomorrow with a full day of events out at Poly Canyon. Reporting in San Luis Obispo, Austin Herbaugh, KSBY News.